Hi, I'm Hope, and here we are captivating a godly home inside and out through Christ Jesus. I hope you enjoy the channel. Welcome, and I hope you have a blessed day. Hey, y'all. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are doing great. I'm doing wonderful. So today I want to share with you my Walmart beautiful haul of some kitchen items that I wanted to refresh in my kitchen. And I got this a little bit over time and I need to go ahead and open it up because I'm starting to organize as my cabinets and stuff, the doors start to dry, doing that in between. And so let's see how fast I can unbox this stuff and show you guys because um, I have some other stuff to do. I need to do my homework and stuff like that. But welcome. But welcome, y'all. Welcome to the channel. My name is Hope. And here on the channel, we talk about faith, family, and home. And just look around on the channel. There are all different types of videos uh, from grocery hauls, cooking videos, DIY, home, organization. We talk about Jesus and all the things, y'all. And um, a few vlogs in there with my family. So my hair is up. Um, I'm painting. And I try to go down my list what I have to do today. So I need to run out right quick. And right now I've been decluttering. I did this shelf yesterday and I did down here. So I need to put this stuff out. Um, not necessarily on the countertops because I need to do my countertops. You see the, I pulled the peeling stick up and, um, I need to make that appointment today, go to Lowe's and all the things y'all. So let's get started. So the first thing I have is a six cord programmable slow cooker and I kind of just wanted everything to coordinate. I wanted to match since I repainted my cabinets. I had dark, dark, dark cabinets. I'll see if I find a picture, but um, I'm going to see how big this is because I do have a larger one and that one my mom gave me, so I'm going to keep it. So um, yeah, I just want to know what to keep, what to, what to get rid of. Um, the next thing I have is the nonstick cookware set. I did look at a lot of reviews and some people said that they didn't like it. They did. I would just want to try it for myself. I do see where Sam's has um, something similar. Um, I'm trying to, I was thinking about getting it, but I'm trying to have less cookware. If you saw some cookware on the counter, I'm probably going to give that away. And then I did kind of like a vlog yesterday and I was talking about how um what was i talking about how it's still good and how it's hard for me to let go of something if i know i spent money on it and it's still good um especially pots i don't know why but you should give people stuff away i was taught or brought up give people stuff things that um you would still want and so i think that's part of woman and the other pans are from Marshalls. So I am a little nervous to get rid of stuff um, you'll see in a second that I know that are good products just because I wanted to coordinate. And then I may not never do that again, ever again. So we'll see, because um, I do use my pans a lot. So you get 12 pieces, I open that. Then over here, the extra large electric griddle. I do have a griddle already. And, um, but I like this one because it has a guard. Um, yeah. And the one that I have currently, like everything that I did get, it was a reason why. And I guess I share as I go. So the griddle that I currently have, I think it's a Presto. And when it's closer, hopefully this doesn't, I did watch a review on this. I'm asking y'all a review on this. And this little, for some reason, the heating mechanism on the Presto, it's really hot, you know, and then it's cool over here, which is good when you're cooking because you don't want everything to cook evenly. Sometimes you need stuff to cook a little bit slower, but um, this, was a, this was a win for me. And then I think they say you can immerse this as well. So it was all different features. I was like, okay, I'm going to try it. I got the 5-in-1 expandable skillet with accessories. And I decided to get this because we've been getting those uh, Trader Joe's meals. And, you know, sometimes you have a skillet meal and you don't want to dirty up a whole pot or turn on the stove or something like that. So I just wanted to try this. And 
I don't know if my mom decided to get this or not, but she wanted to see how big it was. Was it too big, like for a family or something? Um, I did contemplate if I wanted to get the cutlery set uh, because I've had one before with a block and I kind of wanted less things on the counter, even though it may not happen that way. So I just said, I'll try it. I'll try it. Now, we did need a new air fryer. To me, from past experience, Ninja is the best. I love Ninja products. So uh, the reason why I didn't get the two, Ninja has like a two drawer one. I don't really like the aesthetic of the Ninjas. They're big, they're bulky, they take up a lot of space, but they're really good products. So I just wanna just give this a try um, and see how it works. We did need like a two drawer because a lot of times when we're cooking something, we have to run it two or three times because we've run out of space. Um, and then also our pan has really, and I was looking through my photos, is worn out. So I was looking through my photos and sometimes I go through my phone looking for certain stuff or just browsing and I see the date of, cause I have lots and lots of pictures and videos in my phone and I see the date and I'm like, oh, I didn't realize I had the air fryer for four years or something like that. And, um, no wonder the Teflon and it's hard to clean because, you know, it's still, I didn't use all the functions on it yet. Some I have used more than others and I just need a new one. Um, I needed a new one anyway. This is perfect to add. Okay, so the toaster oven. Um, I went back and forth. I think this is the first thing I bought and I love my Ninja toaster oven, but I only use certain features on it. I had it long enough to know we use the pizza, we use the toast from time to time. We use um, the air fryer, but I like the consistency of the air fryer in the air fryer because it's, con it's, it's concealed. It has a dome on it, and I like the oven, my stove oven, as an air fryer. So anyway, I also got that bigger one because our stove was not working at one time. And so anyway, uh, just looking at the different settings and it was a low profile and aesthetically pleasing that's why i got that okay the care rig i did think about getting this i had it in my save later forever it's at walmart it's white and it matches my other beautiful already have her coffee pot um over there and um you know and then also the descale button i love this one more so than the one that's in my craft room it's a little different Carrig, but this one, um, the descal button, I know I cleaned it. I don't know if it's a reset button somewhere, but it's still highlighted. And then I realized, oh, hope you had that. You know how you try to justify, but I have had it for a little while, so I was like, okay, I go ahead and get um, the white one, so everything on my coffee bar look nice. I got the eight quart ceramic non stick stock pot, I do use this for different, different different things i like to have a big pot so i went back and forth to make sure i didn't have a big pot in this set this is larger than that pot up there and then i did get the six piece cutlery I to go ahead and um get this as well y'all um and then i need to organize this drawer over here and then my knife organizer comes today from amazon so i just wanted to go ahead and open it throw these boxes away and um, that's what I'm dreading the most is breaking the boxes down. But I'm, I'm grateful. I don't want to complain. So let's get started and open um, this crock pot up. All right, y'all. I won't show every single thing because y'all probably, and I only had this camera angled correctly. I still talk a little bit more than I wanted to talk. I'll fix the camera, y'all, one second. Oh, then I waited too, because it was recycle day the other day and trash day the other day. So it needed to be like less trash. So this is what it looks like, y'all. And I don't know if I had any, um, saw any reviews on the crock pot or not. Ooh, I didn't know I had that. So it has like um, a holder for your cords back here in the back. Neat, neat, neat. I think I still gonna keep my other one for sentimental reasons. And then I'm gonna, I'm not gonna get no crock pots no time soon. Usually I use, I keep myself for a long time. I still got one 
but it has multiple i love stuff that has multiple functions it can't just do one thing you know that crock pot does do one thing usually a crock pot just does one thing but i have a wolfgang puck um crock pot light slow cooker that i had and when i store it y'all i don't know if y'all do that too I turn the lid upside down i usually store it in my pantry and i want to redo that but i have to see because i have some homework to do i'm pulling my backsplash off too y'all so let's see i have a plug right here so i can plug it in let me show y'all So it has like this touch screen. You can see it like that. I'll make sure I turn it off. But let me unplug it because I don't even know how to use it. And I got that stuff on the inside. All right, y'all. So it made me want to cook something. Yeah, before I move on, and I was trying to break this stuff down a little bit by a little bit. It is touch activated, which I said. It's programmable digital countdown timer. Uh, let's see, five preset slow cooking functions and three heat settings, six quarts, and it's supposed to serve seven people. And I think that's it, y'all. I think that is it. So for the nonstick cookware, I'll show you in one second, has four cookware protectors, 10 inch frying pan, eight inch, three quart saute covered pan, five quart casserole, and two quart covered saucepan. Um, here's some other information, oven safe up to 500, including lids, compatible with all stove tops, and it is heavy. So, of course, it's not as heavy as the cast iron, but it is, um, heavier than, uh, Pioneer Woman, I think, and the Paula Deen stuff. So, that is the bigger pan, and then here's the other one. Then this is six quarts, this is eight. Am I right? Um, yeah. And this was kinda, this was like 40, I think it was like 40 some dollars, y'all. Just at one pot. So here is the lid and the, I don't remember. It's a 10 inch and it's quite heavy. And it does look like the other set, look like a dupe of Caraway. And then also, the set from Sam's. So you can go on their website and Sam's has different colors as well. I wonder is it exactly the same? I have to go back and watch the video. I saw someone do a review. And then this one here, you have your lid. And I just wanted to go ahead and open this up so that I can go ahead and organize my cabinet. Even And I know what I need to get as far as organizing it. Um, so then here are your pot protectors. So you put them in there. If you're not familiar with these, so they won't scratch and you stack it. So here are all the ones. And I thought that was neat, they give you that. And then you have this other lid that goes in this saucepan here. So it looks like pretty good quality, y'all. I was trying to see. I don't think they'll last for a while, but we'll see. Y'all, yeah, so the next thing is the griddle. And the features on that is extra large. And I'll show y'all that in one second. It is premium quantum two, uh, free nonstick coating for healthy cooking. I don't remember. Okay. I was going to say something else. Detachable stainless steel backsplash, slim design for easy cabinet storage, and fully immersible for easy cleaning. Like that. And it says it makes 15 pancakes or eggs at once. Well, that's a plus. <laughs> it must be little pancakes. Let's see what else it says. Easy to use dial, ranging from 200 to 400. Dishwasher safe drip tray and powerful 500 watt heating system, 
long lasting material with soft matte premium finish. All right, so I do like my Presto. I do like a griddle to make some breakfast. Um, and this was a win for me because they had the splash guard, which I had to figure out how to put on. It's probably like that. Um, here is the pullout drawer. It comes with these little things, which probably I'm gonna put in the drawer and hope I don't forget they in there. That's to attach the backsplash. And because I do, when sometimes when I'm cooking, I'll get it like um, so popping, especially if it's grease, uh, bacon or sausage or something. So I like that. And then we'll see how, when I did saw the review of someone, it was really, um, looked like it cooked evenly, but sometimes you just don't know. So it does make me a little nervous to get rid of what I already have. Other than I know, like I said, the air fryer, we needed a new one, the toaster oven. I didn't also the Ninja. I loved it, but it's hard to clean. And I think a lot of people felt the same way with the Ninja, the big oven. Uh, my mom, she told me, she's like, I hope it's going to be, um, you have to clean it like right away afterwards. And then the air fryer, y'all know we have an air fryer that pops everywhere. And then it just gets really, uh, dust. it just gets real crusty like. So anyway, I'm going to make sure I read all these books. Um, yeah, and I just wanted something smaller because my toaster oven just take up like the whole, that whole corner over there. And I didn't like that. All right, y'all. So let's open up this cutlery set. So it's stainless steel. It has a soft handle, razor sharp. And it also comes with, let's see, it should say, oh, here it is. So here's the wood block, paring knife. Serrated utility knife, serrated Satuku knife, Satuku knife, a uh, sheet chef knife, six steak knives, and all purpose shears. Right, y'all, I hope nobody will turn this because it's not it's not really wrapped. Oh yes, it is. Okay, glory, glory, glory. Because <laughs> it wasn't like packaged in there, like the other stuff like really wedged in there, but it's wrapped, so glory. All right, so on their website, what I like to do when I see something, especially uh, if it's Walmart, you can click the hyperlink, like beautiful kitchenware or beautiful, and then you'll go to that page and it pulls you up everything that Drew Barrymore has in her line. Or if you're looking for us at Texas Home, whoever you're looking for, y'all, y'all know. Click that hyperlink, um, the home edit. I do that all the time. And then that way you can see like all the things home edit has and um i was like i didn't know they had this i for oh i forgot that they had this because y'all know i was organizing which i still am my um house in different areas and i was using the home edit stuff and they came out with some new stuff and sometimes you may miss it in the store but when you click that or yeah you may miss it when the new line comes out in the store but once it sold, sells out, you may not see it anymore, but it doesn't mean they don't sell it online and they'll have so much more stuff online. So like yesterday, I ordered the um, utility. She has some that will fill, not the utility, will fit the, let me just show y'all, so I'm just talking. The drawer here for your silverware. So it's like clear, a little bit longer, uh, dr little individuals, compartment drawers for your drawer and I wanted to get it for here and back there in the back just the clear ones because I didn't want to have to search and search and search for some bamboo ones that will match the rest of my silverware I'm gonna move this but um it's there for now anyway to say all that is that just search just click on the hyperlink if you didn't know it already for like Walmart that's just trash. I thought I had an instruction book. Okay, y'all. So, I took the plastic off of here. And it smells. That wood smells so good. Let's see. I got to get that out. It's one of those silica packets down in there. So, here are your scissors. I won't take each one because I want to wash it first. Because knowing my family, if they see it, they'll use it. <laughs> without me washing it, it was, you know because they they won't know no better so i know i needed some more of those 
And I just like to get the ones from the Dollar Tree as well when they start getting dull. I, I do have a scissor sharpener, knife sharpener, but hold on. Yeah, so here's the steak knife. I definitely needed some new ones. And I realized I only had two that I found yesterday. And um, yeah, so I think that's a steak knife. Let's pull out a different one. So they do come with these little tips. And then directions, you see it says hand wash only, dry immediately. So I'll do this later. I'll put this over here to the side. Let me be careful with these knives. And um, yeah, I clean this later and then show y'all what it looks like inside. Hopefully I remember. All right, y'all. So the next one is the eight quart ceramic nonstick stock pot. You really can see what this is. Um, it has the same function, same features, oven safe to 500, including the lid. I have to remember that sometimes when I'm cooking. Um, cause some, some lids are not oven safe compatible on all, all stove tops, including induction. I still have that, um, induction one y'all from Aldi. I'm not going to get rid of that. It's in my pantry. And I'm going to redo my pantry. And I had to find somebody. I really, really want some. Hmm, I'm, about to, I'm about to pick up these kitchen shears. <laughs> and cut this paper. But I, I can do it without it. Let's see. I want someone to build in my. Um, and I haven't asked the our handy guy that we found. I haven't asked him if he can. If he does carpentry, but maybe he knows someone that does. All right, y'all. So that's a big pot. And I needed a big pot. I do have a big, big one that I got from finally got from Aldi maybe two years ago. Like for holidays to cook collards and some other things. But this one is a pretty big one. So sometimes I want to boil water. Or, um, I keep seeing this though, y'all. See how it's like, you probably can't really see it. Look like the metal is showing here, like the coating is off. So, and that probably happened in shipping, I bet. But anyway, that's what it looks like, y'all. So that's a pretty big size, cause it's bigger than the one from the Pioneer Woman. Cause yeah, it probably happened in shipping cause this is scratched too. and stuff myself but that's a good seal so you can make it like a good old casserole that dish remind me no well not the dish but putting that lid on it and i said casserole what was that that movie i like and i wouldn't watch it now but i used to like that movie elvira 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 was she a witch I don't know if she was a witch or not. I won't be watching no more. But I used to like to watch it. It's like, you know, a little silly stuff you like to watch. Like, my husband, he likes to watch, um, what is that he like to watch? It's his favorite movie, Little Shop of Horrors. And I don't even know why he liked to watch that because he can't stand musicals. But he likes that. It's just silly to me. Just so silly. Okay, y'all. So, this is the, um, five in one expandable skillet with accessories. And I don't know if my mom about this one or not, because she was wondering if she should. And I'm going to make sure I read my books so I know all the features of my stuff. Because y'all know, it's like your phone and your computer. It has all these features and you don't even use them. Your washing machine, your dryer, I don't even use them. So I'm going to take time out and read it. So, and then I'm going to take a trip to the recycle bin. All right, y'all. So this one is... Five in one saute, steam, simmer, slow cook, buffet serve, and more. Oh, that's an added plus. So you can put this on for entertainment, like put something in here and cook, and it's aesthetically pleasing. Hopefully, it'll stay white like that. Mm -hmm. Okay, so five and seven quart adjustable capacity fits a five pound chicken. It has a lid rest and steam rack included. All right, y'all. I didn't even realize that with accessories. And that's what it looks like on the side. So you can make like a dish like this and 
for your family and you can stay warm. Yeah, something fell, y'all. Hit my bottom of my cabinet. I'm gonna have to put that coating on. I should have did it right away. Of um, poly something about from Lowe's. And um, I don't know what that was. That, oh, this thing right here fell and hit the cabinet. And I can see where it scraped the paint off. And that's why I was nervous to paint my own cabinets, y'all. But they quoted me like $3,000. Yeah. <laughs> To paint my cabinets, and I was like, mm, I don't know about that. All right. Yeah, I need to make a trip to the recycle bin right quick. Okay, let's open and take this paper off. All right, y'all, I like this. This is good for um, so you take that tray off. I forgot why it might be because of this. So, this is like your steamer. So, if you're trying to steam something. So, you can make like a one skillet meal. Also, for entertainment, that's what I'm looking at. How I can stay warm and it's pretty deep. And um, I think this was only like, was it roll back? Or some, it might not have been roll back. I don't remember. But I know it was like, I think 49. But if you got the green one, they got different colors. The green, sage green color, it was like 41. So, I don't know what color mama chose to get if she got it. Here's your lid. And my lid is a little scratched. I don't know if I did that or not. And here's your lid holder. So, let's see. Let me put this on here. All right, y'all. I like this. I didn't think I was going to like this so much. Because sometimes you're like, well, I get this to add to my collection. But this is nice because you, I can see where you can have, um, I w well, it's up to you what you want to get. Especially if you entertain a lot, you can get, you know, three or four of them. Because they look like they may not take up a whole lot of space. You can't take this part off. But I don't think you can. And here's your little nozzle. But at least two of them, especially at that price. And, um, you know, yeah, have some breakfast for Christmas or something for Thanksgiving for your family. Or you have once a month meals or something like that and keep something warm. Yeah, y'all like that. Mm-hmm. Y'all, so this serves 79 people. And it's non-court capacity. Fits a five-pound, fits five pounds of food french fries and a 10 pound turkey i thought i was gonna say chicken uh let's see touch activated display um it's the air fryer boil broil roast bake reheat dehydrate functions oh dehydrate um turbo crisp technology for extra crispy and even cooking superior airflow technology for precise cooking Cooks two different foods at once, sink to finish cooking at the same time. That's cool. Really need that. Tri-zone technology cook two foods at once or remove divider to cook one larger. So certainly need that. Um, again, I do know that I like how the ninja cooks. So, and I know they have a big one. So I'm hope I did see some reviews on this. And I do like the flip top versus the drawer. And that's only because I had one before. And then it seemed like I had two. And the drawer kind of gave out. But it was like a little button in it. So I'm hoping that this will this will um, exceed my expectations. And yeah, y'all. So this is what the inside looks like. I took all the paper out. You can take this divider out. And you take these little things out here. So I'm excited to use this. Excited to use this. We really do use our air fryer. I know you say, well, why do you have a oven that's an air fryer? And that, well, actually, we had the air fryer on the counter first and then the oven, which I thought was a great feature. Um, the consistency is totally different. Um, with the different types of air fryer. So I think this is an air fryer too. And the Ninja of an air fryer. I didn't really care for that too much. Like the French fries just didn't come out the same. Um, I only like the covered whole drawer or the lid air fryer. As far as my French fries, they get crispy. The wings will get crispy. It just takes a little bit longer um, in the oven. 
when you do the oven air fryer function and then your oven gets really i need to clean it tomorrow or today this evening um it gets really dirty really dirty because stuff is popping everywhere but anyway um they do have the single one as well so if you want to get that but i know this works for us and let's see what the back looks like y'all with the cord okay so that's what the cord looks like it's pretty long and then it looks like it has rubber feet at the bottom um so it won't slide and stuff like that but yeah y'all your touch screen is here okay y'all so this has 10 preset functions toast bagel air fryer broil bake pizza reheat cookies slow cook slow cook dehydrate so a lot of them have the same features but they may not cook the same because like i said before but anyway air fry function for crispy food without fat um serves five to seven people a large uh 15 is that liter capacity and infrared quartz heating elements with three speed convection fan 80 percent faster it also has the audible ready signal alerts you when cooking is complete dishwasher safe rack bait pan air frying mesh basket uh, for easy cleanup removable crumb tray makes cleaning simple uh powerful 800 1800 watt heating system touch eliminates only when you need it and adjustable three speed convection fan setting with low low turbo fan turbo all right y'all so the only thing i didn't like about the ninja it was big um the air fry function is not the best but i did like it i liked it a lot it does cook um well um sometimes with bacon it did take a little bit longer depending on what it was uh let's see it cooks pizza to perfection um i'm still be talking about beautiful i'm talking about ninja but i just wanted to let you know like well I kind of, yeah, I kind of know. Anyway, y'all. So, also, what else with the Ninja? Um, It, it has, like, these... Uh, Y'all know how in the toaster ovens, it has those, like, long light, um, eyes, like, the heating element in it. And it seemed like you could drop things on it. And that that's why it seemed like it made it hard to clean. Because you didn't want to put your baking soda and your vinegar all in there. And it falls on those eyes. Um, even when it was off, of course. And something else. Oh, so the settings on the Ninja. Setting on the Ninja, the, uh, the dials up here rub off. So, I can't even remember what these said before, but they rub off. And it just gets real crusty, y'all. It gets really crusty, um, just being transparent. And it just seems like it's hard to clean. It's not the biggest aesthetically pleasing, but it cooks well. Ninja has, again, some good products. Um, I think a lot of other people had issues with the cleaning aspect so I searched on YouTube if anybody did a video on it and they didn't. Um, and then someone, I, I saw where I think Ninja did, but they just literally took it out the box, uh, was giving tips on a brand new Ninja. So you have to get the Ninja to see what I'm talking about. And then you have to be really consistent at cleaning it right away. And people usually, I'm just being honest, y'all. People don't clean their, um, this is like your stove. You don't clean your stove right away. I had had some smaller toaster ovens that I cleaned right away, but I wasn't able to do so much in it. Like I just maybe bake some stuff and toast. And I think it's that air fry sitting that really gets it really um, gunky. Cause even my Ninja air fryer doesn't look that bad. But one day I looked up and the dome ones have a um eye at the top of the lid which i didn't even realize and that is um you can wipe it off from time to time but that gets gunky too all right y'all so this one has i'm um, a tray and usually what i do is i'll put foil on the tray for easy cleanup um the ninja tray i have to be honest has a coating on it 
this might be better not to have a coating. I don't know. But um, I don't know how well this is going to hold up the cleaning. So you probably going to make a fool on it after a while. But y'all know with certain... It kind of reminds me of... It's a little bit heavier. But it reminds me of the pans that you get from... Y'all know the inexpensive... Ooh, I like how it is sleek. It almost reminds you... Now, Beautiful does have a microwave too, y'all. But I don't need a microwave. So if you need a microwave, get you all the things in a microwave cart and everything. I remember the house we had... I know I'm too close. The house we had before here, it was an older house that we rented. And um, I had everything matchy-matchy. I had coordinate, and I wanted a red kitchen. And I'm surprised, y'all... I had a red kitchen. Well, it was a lot of brown in there because it's an old kitchen. And um, so I had to make it really nice. So this is your crumb tray. And so you can go in the dishwasher. Now this feels like it has a coating on it, but the other pan don't seem like it has a coating on it. But I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep the other pan and use that one in here. And then, but that is a good pan. So, um, yeah, I had a red kitchen. I had the apple thing in my kitchen. That's why I had red. So I had red everything. And I think red was uh, in because I was able to find a red microwave. I had a red um, dish rack. I had a red everything. And I haven't had a thing in my kitchen in a while. So this is kind of exciting to have an all white and gold thing. Um, maybe marble with some hints of bamboo or some wood because I don't want it all white and gold. Okay, so here's my book. Take this out. Here is my rack. I'm trying to see if it's the same width as the other one. I like this basket. Let's see y'all. So at least what beautiful. Let me show y'all. You see how they covered the eyes at least with these things? Ninja didn't do that. So they're open. Let me flip it around. Another thing of beautiful that I have in my wish list or have in my save later, I should say, car is the toaster. But I keep my toaster, I keep most of my appliances in my regular pantry um so we don't use the toaster too much and you can use this but jj does get a little uh when he has certain things and i get it when he has like when i make tuna fish they like to toast their sandwiches and he likes it in the toaster so jason's the same way so that's the reason why we got a toaster i forgot um so i may get the beautiful toaster i don't need the six toaster only two and but I'm fine with just using the oven or using this. Um, and you use the air fryer too to toast. Um, I tend to forget that unless it's like like I'm toasting something for myself, reheating something or something. And uh, what else, y'all? I think it's a personal blender. Um, I was thinking about getting that. I'm not gonna get a blender blender because we got a ninja blender. Um, and yeah, and that's fine because I do I like ninja. But I love how sleek and how um, they look. Okay, lastly in the beautiful set, the cutlery. It is um, a lifetime limited warranty. I don't know if you have to register it or anything. I don't know I had an Instagram and a TikTok cook with beautiful stainless steel and Is that a paring knife? It looks really long. Or is that the utility knife? It looks really long. Um, this is the Sudo Sudoku knife. I usually use this one a lot for a lot of different things. Um, that's the chef's knife up there. I don't use that too much. Hold on. This is the serrated utility knife. So let me put this over here so I can wash that when I come back. 
put it over there. Mm -mm. Oh, that's your paring knife. I'm gonna put this stuff in the recycle. It's taking up a lot of space. Okay, y'all, so with all the tape off, this is the Carrie K Express Essentials, and this works for my husband and I. We really like this. You have the option of choosing six cups, eight, I'm sorry, six ounces, eight ounces, or 10 ounces, and a lot of times we pick the eight or the 10, um, 36 ounces of water. Is this 36 ounces? removable reservoir so this lifts up like that and this is going to show all <laughs> every coffee splatter but it's really easy to clean up you have your um i don't know what you call that but if you have a bigger mug you'll take this out or a bigger travel mug and you can clean this out i'm not sure if you can put in dishwasher or not because dishwasher putting everything in the dishwasher is um new to me right now <laughs> and let's see you get a book last time i got this they gave you some coupons i don't see that in here but it's okay um let's see yeah k-pods you can use a refillable one you know my drawer is really junky i think i got this off of amazon so I'll see if I put it in my Amazon storefront. I didn't get the ones from Walmart because uh, I was looking at them and a gentleman just said, don't waste your time getting those because them don't work. And I think it was the ones that were on the strip. And he said it was a different type, kind or whatever. So I just said I would get it off of Amazon and read the re reviews. So that's it, y'all. That is it. Um it that's it and um let me clean this mess up and if i get anything else it may be the toaster and but i wanted to see i didn't want it to go ahead and open it up i only wanted to use it y'all <laughs> um i wanted to open it up so i can see where to put certain things because i want to redo my pantry i don't think i'm gonna do it today but i'm gonna at least organize at least two of these drawers i want to do something and put another coat of paint on my cabinets. And that probably it today because I have to do my homework, y'all. And I really want to tackle my spices. But anyway, I'll let y'all go. See you in the next video. Bye.